well. The following contest is an extreme rules match. Okay. And it's for the championship. Introducing the challenger remember, from Traverse City, watched, Michigan, weighing in WWE at 275 had, uh, pounds, uh, WrestleMania. Nate he had, uh, forfeit. Byron, what's the game plan for these superstars heading into this triple threat match? Well, Michael, a lot of times you'll see a competitor lurking in the weeds, just yeah, waiting for the right time to strike. But knowing these three superstars the way I do, I doubt we'll see any of them standing by idly here tonight. And his brother ended up winning it. Then you saw on SmackDown. I thought this guy just got blacklisted. Got a Bullet Club shirt on. And introducing the challenger from Detroit, Michigan, weighing in at 220 pounds, Brindleman Ross. Byron, if there's been a more highly anticipated triple threat match in recent memory, I can't recall it. Me neither, Michael. Given the three competitors involved here, I think it's safe to say that heading in, this is among the most eagerly anticipated triple threat matches in recent memory. Just one the YouTube championship. And introducing the champion from Ann Arbor, Michigan, weighing in at two hundred thirty nine pounds. He is the television all-star heritage and honor Guys, while well, exciting, champion, we have to remember that triple threat Jonathan matches are incredibly Turner. dangerous. Especially when a two-on-one attack takes place, which is inevitably going to happen at some point here tonight, Michael. Face. This is right it. After, Triple wow. threat action right here. Right after the champion. Shoulder right in the midsection. Harsh impact. And stopping away in the corner. You better be careful not to get disqualified. you got to believe this one's over. Got it. Michael, that sledgehammer can cause some serious damage. Ooh, what impact. Up and... and for an old-timer, Randall Ross has... Ooh, right to the face. He just keeps getting quicker and quicker as the years progress. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Bringing it back between the ropes. Oh, 
what a stomp. Good grief. Uh-oh. This just ain't gonna do it. And he breaks free just when you thought he was out of this one. Ooh! Whack! Mike, well, that gives new meaning to have a seat. Nailed it! It's always important to get off to a strong start in a match. It's even more important to do that in a triple threat match, given that you're going up against two opponents at the same time. Add to that the no disqualification stipulation, and there's... This could be the turning point, Cole. Oh, nasty impact. This might be it. Oh, my. Byron, you spoke about this before. A competitor must do everything they can do to start things off on the right. I'm not sure if the referee didn't blow that call. Not yet. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. Oh, impactful slam. Boom, what impact. Oh, brutal. And that one grounds him. I didn't realize he had such a glass jaw. Eric Spear! Incredible. Clearly, the shoulders are down. I'll tell you, watching Come Extreme on. Rules matches make me happy. My in-ring days are behind me. You talk about a treacherous environment to compete in. And the champ kicks out. Still too fresh. A bad place to be for the challenger. We're all going to find out what he's made of here in this triple threat match. This match certainly isn't trending in the right direction for him. He's going to need a change in momentum and fast. The no disqualification stipulation in a triple threat match can take the battle in many directions, and each one is more unexpected than the next. A superstar can be attacked with a weapon and can be assaulted by an individual who's not even signed to compete in the match, and the contest will continue because everything's legal. To know that someone could bludgeon you with a sledgehammer, lay you out with a chair, or beat you with a kendo stick, or you can be attacked by someone who's not in the match, and the referee can't do anything about it. It makes things very difficult if you're on the receiving end of assaults like that. In matches like this, guys, you learn very quickly which superstars have what it takes to truly get extreme. This is going to be big one way or another. When this guy's on, look out. He's making a statement here with this attack. Oh, right to the side of the face. Oh, right to the face. Destroyed. What a dive. He could do it here. Beautiful technique. And he kicks out. Not yet. We've seen it on so many occasions. A schoolboy. Here we go. Oh, boy. He is rolling. Oh, and a step there. That'll give you whiplash. What a stomp. Good grief. Schoolboy. He's left wide open here. I don't think he even realizes it. He looks dazed. This is about to get bad. Ooh, earth-shattering spine buster. Just when you thought we were going to crown a new champion. Uh-oh. Oh. This might be it, guys. If at first you don't succeed. Yeah. Boom! <laughs> Schoolboy out of nowhere. Here's the pin. Title on the line. He's got plenty of gas left in his tank. Gonna take more than that. Point of the elbow. Nailed it. Oh, man. What a light drop. What a strike. Oh, my God. A close line. Oh, boy, he is rolling. The match isn't even over, and I can already tell you that this is one of the most exciting... He's not going to go quietly. No superstar worth his soul ever does. Back in the ring now. He's looking at it. This might be it. Oh, my. I think this is the beginning of the end, Michael. Three. And the triple threat is over. This place is going nuts. Let's take another look at these guys getting after it. Overall, this match was average at best.
But not every match is going to be memorable. In fact, Here I've almost forgotten it happened already. And new television all-star heritage and honor champion, Rendleman Ross. An amazing contest comes to a close following a decisive pinfall victory. That's the kind of action you expect.